Nice tips for study success are to make a commitment to your study and set aside the time you really need, to learn how you study best because everyone studies in different ways, to take some breaks and keep a balance between your personal life and your study, and most importantly, to ask for help when you need it. Your lecturers and tutors are here to help you and there are many other support services at the university to provide the help that you might need to study in the best way that you can. My tip for a successful learner is to be an engaged learner. Being able to participate in your classes, whether they're on campus or online, engaging with all of the materials that your lecturer provides and also to engage with your other student colleagues. What we're looking for is students who are motivated, uh, they're committed, uh, they've got a drive and we can see that, that passion uh, when they're attending classes. We want you to be asking questions, to be switched on and if you're not sure that you do speak up and you take advantage of all the facilities that we have to offer. Also, don't be afraid to explore some of the things that take you out of your comfort zone. Studying a trimester abroad, going out and working in the community, it's all important and can enhance your degree. If you feel overwhelmed by any of the concepts, please ask someone, go to your lecturer, speak to your tutor or even a course advisor that will help you because if we don't know that you're having problems and you just drop out, we just can't help you. There's nothing we haven't heard before and there are always solutions. The one thing we don't want you to do is just simply give up on your course and any of the units that you're taking. To be successful as a student, they have to do three things. Firstly, learning to grasp the concept of critical thinking and also go beyond the rote learning. This is to help them to look at issues and to be able to debate on the issues. And secondly, to understand how to interact with other people from the different cultural contexts. And thirdly and lastly is to gain awareness. Awareness of how people interact and how to communicate with other people, to be able to listen and to be able to relate and to be able to communicate and to be able to work in a team. My tips for successful learning is have good time and resource management techniques. That is, make a timetable and realistically plan out all the things that you need to do. And it's not just enough to have a timetable, even on a bright sunny day when there's more fun things to do, even when the task is hard, just making sure that you keep working on it. And lastly, believe in yourself. Successful learners have really high confidence in their ability to achieve their goals, so you just need to believe that you can do it.